also we reached the spot it's not that far away because today we expect it to be very windy in the afternoon so we stayed closer to the shore maybe I would say like approximately 20 kilometers away from the shore which is like I don't know 12 miles or so and the depth is around 30 meters so also not that deep but still they say it's a good spot for Chernia so the captain said in Agua we can throw it in I'm fishing this 200 gram in Chico I guess less would be also fine but let's try first this one yeah so hit the ground yeah bounce it off the ground a few times okay i actually got something that was fast i just bounced it off i guess yeah that could be a red porgy yeah it's fighting good at though the rod is like up to 330 grams so Still giving a good fight. But now we got it. Yeah, it's a red porgy. Not a bad one though. Not a bad one. It is actually a very nice red porgy. Let's show it. Nice first fish great next drop first fish on the rod on the new rod the drift is quite hard quite rough to the ground Ah no, that's a stick fish. Second drop, second species, but you're going back. So, as explained in my last Mar de Plata video, we repeat the drift over the reef. So, the captain just screamed en agua or el agua, no, en agua, I guess, in the water. So, we, we are above this micro position, we drift over it, and then if we catch enough fish, we repeat it.
small corgi. It's my guess. Yeah, small. What I want to show you now was one drift of around 10 minutes where I had three drops and I got three fish. Not the biggest of the day, but it was just that every single drop I got a fish, so I wanted to share that with you. Well, after I got so many fish with the Inchiku, I decided that I wanted to try something different. So I took a soft plastic calamari from the company GLC. I'm not getting sponsored by them, I bought them. But I wanted to try that. Many people in Croatia fish on them, so I said, hey, why, why not try them out? Maybe they work here as well. Well, see how it worked out. So, let's see now. If that's the game changer. I would really be surprised if that's a porgy, that would be a great porgy, but it's not fighting like one. It's a big grouper. It's a nice grouper. Take one last look at the place that you are leaving. I lost it, mother. Suka was a nice grouper, would have been tasty. Yeah, that's a porgy. The smallest, the smallest one. Back into the game. That one? 
Oh, that's a better fish. I hope that's a porgy. It's fighting like a porgy. That would be a great porgy. It is, but it's not that great. I think I can now fish from here. Did we get that's that's bigger that's bigger <laughs> besugo Salmon y besugo. Oh man. Wow. Second spot, I guess, yeah, third drop. I just had a du the double strike, a small porgy and the salmon, what they call, on English it's called sand perch. Good. I'm a little angry that I lost the grouper, but hey, come on. One door closes, another one opens, so everything good. This is for whatever reason empty.
so now something new put on a 180 gram slow jig as you see no bait nothing i also want to try that let's see we know that fish are there i see the guys are catching i caught fish so i'm curious how good in comparison to the let's say artificial lures which i decorated with some calamari squid parts so in comparison to that how this slow jig without anything will catch i'm pretty curious I lost it. Yeah. Forty. Small one, but the first on the slow jig. Very typical. Ah, small metal. Nice. Third species of the slow chick. So apparently they all want it.
new spot, maybe the last one for today. Captain said it's a grouper spot, so I changed to Inchiku. This compact style, first of all, lets me sink much faster, and second of all, I think I will try to stay as much on the bottom as possible. We got something heavy. Now we got something good. Now we got something good. That's a benefit. That's a benefit. That's the biggest fish of the day. Cannot see it. Matthias! Matthias! So guys, that's the end of the fishing day. It was a long day. I got so many fish, really. I, I need to tell you that I took out exactly 10 fish. So 10 fish which I caught this day, I did not put into that because otherwise the video would be too long. I 
like this fishing day, to be honest. I started with my Inchiku. Also, I closed the session with the Inchiku, my favorite vertical jigging lure. I then switched to the GLC soft plastic, so something different. And after that, I tried then slow jigging without any additional bait, and it also worked out. So I'm actually very happy. I got so many red porgy, so many red porgy. This is also why I decided to have this video title. Although I got a nice Chernia and I got a nice Salmon and plenty of other fish, but well, it was really a red porgy madness. I hope you liked this video. I hope you like all the videos I'm posting and I hope you are already subscribed. If not, please subscribe, hit the like button, leave a comment and see you next time in the third Mar del Plata series video.